I'm Sarah Ringer from InflamedAndUntamed.com here with Marissa Troy, who is one of the Intense Intestines Foundation team members. Um, Marissa, what are the first words that come to your mind when you hear inflammatory bowel disease? Um, something about having to do the bathroom. So, pooping. Yeah, basically pooping. Okay, cool. Because most people pretty much think that it's about something with digestive crash. disorders, yeah. something along those lines. Yeah. And is it really about that? It's not only about that, no. What's the first thing that comes to mind when you hear the words inflammatory bowel disease? I wonder what exactly does that mean? Does it happen to everyone? Okay. So if I were to tell you some of the symptoms, like going to the bathroom very frequently, stomach pain, cramping, uh, rectal bleeding, some of the really bad symptoms that people go through, fevers, night sweats, and long hospitalizations, what do you think of then when I say inflammatory bowel disease? Well, now I think I'd like to help those people or at least learn more about it, how they get to their through their day-to-day -day life. Good question. What's the first thing you think about when you hear the words inflammatory bowel disease? I think that people don't know that there's so many other people out there to support them in the group that you have here and the other groups that are functioning within this type of group. What are the first words that come to mind when you think of things that have to do with inflammatory bowel disease? Well, the first words that used to come to mind for me are things like fear and embarrassment and being ashamed of myself and just really being closeted with this disease. Of course, if you ask me today, obviously it's a different story and I feel empowerment and obviously still, you know, there's the pain and the embarrassment and all that kind of stuff, but it's a different story today than it was. So, you have colitis. What are some of the first things that come to mind when you hear the words inflammatory bowel disease? Well, I mean, for me, it was a little life-changing. I mean, not as much for most people because my dad has had it for 25 years. He just had the surgery, but you know, he's had a great comeback. So that gave me a lot of experience and wisdom to draw upon. But I mean, the first thing that comes to mind is like, you know, there's a little shame, some stigmatism. You know, obviously, it's not the most talked about thing ever. It is what it is. I can't control it, and if you see me running with a toilet paper roll, guess what? Get over it. Everyone does it. I just do it a little more than others. <laughs> we all go to the bathroom. We use the other. I go to the bathroom in a mouse to me. It doesn't really matter. We all do it. So you were here last year. Right. Yeah, and it was my first ever IBD event. I never even talked, opened up about anything before. So and now a year later, I'm here, and it's, it's actually a really big deal for me. So this. Coming to this event here last year was like the thing that got you more comfortable with coming out and talking to people who have yeah. inflammatory bowel disease. It did. It really opened the door for me to kind of embrace my community. Before that, I was just really nervous about everything and I was really ashamed of everything that I had gone through. Um, what's one way that you think you might want to reach out to the community and help somebody um, with events like these or the Intense Intestines yeah. Foundation? Yeah, the events like these are a lot of fun because it's not, you know, there's no pressure and it's not heavy. It's fun. It's showing people active and it shows that it's not a, you don't have to just lay in bed <laughs> if you have the disease. You don't have to just not have a life. I'm having a good time. I was here last year and we're so excited to come back. Um, everyone's so good here at the Rock Club and it's just fun to get back and back out and get climbing. I very seldom do it so it's always fun to come here. Um, the raffles are always great. It's great to see all the smiling faces and at the end to know that it's all for a good cause. Kiana, are you having a good time? Yes, I'm having a great time. Awesome. What's been your favorite thing so far? Just climbing and getting to the top. Awesome. What about you, Deidre? Um, it's probably just all the new people I've met and I think Sweet! Erica, you seem pretty excited about your first time climbing. First time! How many times have you gotten to the top? Every time. No, uh, I didn't go twice, but um, almost the first time I did. So Every time. So I'm your... You did a very good job. She's no. so excited. She's never climbed. Pumped out. Some pumped out forearms. Never climbed. You can do it. <laughs>